were same kids. Some were eager, some had to push, but in no time, we all were in the groove. Learning Python, making our moves. Strings and lists, dictionaries, two code spaces like call up GitHub, it's true. And UI, UX, we explored it all. Pandas, NumP, we answered the call. The S group camp, we made new friends. Coding together, the fun never ends. From AI art to Blue Kid and more, we learned so much, but there's still much more in store. We created personas, learned to engineer prompts With experts guiding, we took the right jumps Safety, health, and meteorology Disaster management, we learned with glee Challenges like logo design, TikTok 2 Parodies and AI art, we all came through Building chatbots, it took dedication But the fun we had, what a sensation At school camp, we made new friends Coding together, the fun never ends From AI art to blue kid and more We learned so much, but there's still much more in store At every turn, special thanks to sponsors and the crew You made this journey something new Now we leave, but we'll never forget The memories made the fun we had yet Echo Camp will stay in our hearts This is just the beginning and we're ready to chart Thanks to all, let's raise our voices high To the future we go, aiming for the sky At the Echo Camp we made new friends Coding together, the fun never ends from the Miss Khalifa is someone, somebody, 
a friend who truly cares about you and your needs. So I can't wait to show her in action. Meet Tyler. She's new in St. Kitts, just moved here and trying to figure things out. But here's the thing. Tyler made a questionable choice. She had sex with a boy. With a plastic bag. Yep, you heard that right. Luckily for Tyler, she came across Miss Khalifa. An AI chatbot designed just for teens like her. Unsure of what to do next, Tyler starts chatting with Miss Khalifa. Typing, I had sex with a plastic bag, and I don't know what to do. Miss Khalifa gets it. She speaks teen lingo fluently, no judgment, just real talk. She responds with an answer that's both straight up and packed with helpful information. Now, Tyler's starting to worry. What if she has an STI? Her mind is racing and she's getting paranoid. Could it be HIV? She wants to know the stats on HIV in St. Kitts. Miss Khalifa pulls up the data in seconds. Even if Tyler prefers tables, Miss Khalifa's got it covered. Tyler's nerves are kicking in. This could be serious. She decides it's time to get tested. But where? Miss Khalifa suggests some options. But wait, Tyler's having second thoughts. Maybe private testing is the way to go. Miss Khalifa's got her covered with all the details she needs. Tyler is so paranoid that she is now having the worst of thoughts, and now she really needs some help. Of course, Miss Khalifa is ready to assist. Once again, we see how Miss Khalifa ensures the user feels comfortable and unjudged, while respectfully avoiding questionable topics she cannot answer. Tyler's feeling a bit better now, but the fear is still there. Good thing she has Miss Khalifa, the go-to buddy for all things Not sexual kidding. health, here to guide Not you kidding. no matter what. See, this is what makes Miss Khalifa truly awesome. She doesn't just give boring texture plays. You can check out cool graphs and tables that actually make stuff easy to get. And guess what? We're adding features soon, like maps, to show where you can get help and even book appointments with doctors. We have already begun having meetings with several medical practitioners who have expressed interest with sharing referrals with us. So teens, you now you know who Miss Khalifa is. Make sure you use her. Remember, she can only answer if you ask her. What will you ask her today? Thank you. Since demo and presentation, well done. Um, the question I would ask is if your chatbot is live, and then also, or better, let me ask this question. So I saw that your chatbot was able to show images. Can you explain how you did that? That was really impressive. <laughs> uh, yes, Ms. Khalifa could uh, display graphs and tables uh, if you request data. So how we did it, uh, we just asked the chatbot to return um, a JSON response of the data and we handled it, we converted it into a chat and displayed it. Girl Gia, I was caught in a downpour yesterday on my way to school. That sounds awful. Did you not check the weather before you left? I didn't have time. I wish I had something quick and reliable to check while I was rushing out the door. You should try this chat box for a quick real-time update anywhere, anytime. It provides accurate weather info tailored for residents and visitors of this federation. Whether you're planning a day out or a trip, this chat box helps you stay prepared. See how the weather in St. Kitts can be unpredictable? And traditional methods of checking the weather, like apps or websites, often don't provide the localized, timely information needed. It is also a, tra a traffic emergency prone federation. Residents and tourists alike face challenges in planning their daily activities due to unreliable or generalized forecasts. 
there is a clean, a clear need for solution that delivers accurate real-time weather updates in a convenient and user-friendly manner. Our solution to this problem is a user-friendly chatbot that provides instant weather updates tailored specifically for St. Kitts and Nevis. Its name is Navi. Unlike generic weather apps, our chatbot engages users in natural conversation, offering not just current weather conditions, but also forecasts, severe weather alerts, traffic emergencies, and personalized recommendation based on location and activity. For example, if a tourist asks about beach conditions, Navi can provide the current temperature, wind speed, and even UV index. If a farmer wants to know the best time to water crops, Navi can provide insights based off rainfall forecasts. It's an all-in-one solution that keeps users informed, whether they're on the go or planning ahead. St. Kitts and Nevis have a growing population and a thriving tourism industry, both of which depend heavily on accurate weather information. With over a million visitors annually and thousands of locals whose daily lives are weather dependent, the market for a localized intelligent weather solution is vast. Additionally, businesses in sectors such as tourism, agriculture, and event management are looking for more efficient ways to plan and operate. for disaster management and emergency alerts. Navi provides real-time information on hurricanes. Here, it shows you the latest updates on Hurricane Laura, including its location, movement, and potential impact. You can also view an interactive map to track the storm's path and find nearby shelters. With Navi, you can customize the alerts you receive and report traffic incidents in real time. Stay aware of emergencies as they happen and contribute to the community's safety. One minute. Personalize Navi to suit your preferences from changing the bot's persona to receiving context-aware greetings. Navi is designed to enhance your experience. Started with Navi today and stay safe during emergencies. Join, Join us, us in revolutionizing the way Sankits and Nevis stay informed about, about the weather. weather. Let's, Let's work together to ensure that weather. residents, tourists, and businesses never, never miss a beat, no, no matter what, what the weather brings. If you are ready to be part of this exciting opportunity, Let's connect and discuss how we can make this vision a reality. Let's bring Navi to our Federation. In very good work, I must say, that have integrated the AI chatbots with um, voice enable interfaces, or if in the near future that you will be using voice enabled interfaces for your chatbot. Navi is still in its developmental phase but that is certainly something that we would want to implement in the future. Okay, good job. Aiden, revolutionizing emergency care solution with smart patient ass assessment. <laughs> Introduction to Aiden. Aiden aims for... Well, Aiden aims to transform emergency care in St. Lucia through smart patient assessment 
technologies by leveraging artificial intelligence. We can enhance the accuracy of diagnosis, streamline processes, and ultimately saving lives. This presentation will explore how Eden can revolutionize the healthcare landscape in the region. Emergency care in St. Lucia faces numerous challenges such as long time waits, limited resources, and inadequate patient assessment. These factors can lead to misdiagnosis and impact effective treatment. Understanding these challenges is crucial for implementing AI solutions that can improve patient outcomes. How Eden works. Eden utilizes advanced algorithms and machine learning to assess patient conditions rapidly. It analyzes symptoms, medical history, and vital signs to provide healthcare professionals with critical insights. This technology ensures that patients receive the right care at the right time, enhancing the overall efficiency of emergency services. Benefits of smart patient assessment. Implementing smart patient assessments can lead to significant improvements in emergency care, including reduced wait times, increased diagnostic accuracy, and better resource allocation. By providing real-time data, Aiden empowers medical staff to make informed decisions quickly, ultimately leading to improved patient safety and satisfaction. Case studies and success stories. Various healthcare systems worldwide have successfully integrated AI technologies into their emergency care protocols. These case studies demonstrate how Aiden can replicate these successes in St. Lucia showcasing improved patient outcomes, reduce costs, and enhance operational efficiency. Learning from these examples can help guide our implementation strategy. Conclusion, the future of emergency care. In conclusion, it represents a pivotal shift in how we approach emergency care in St. Lucia by adopting smart patient assessment technologies we can address current challenges significantly improve healthcare delivery. The future emergency service lies in harnessing the power of artificial intelligence for better patient care. We'll now be doing a short um, presentation demo of our chatbot. Hello, Mr. Tom. I'm here to ask you a few questions to help the doctor evaluate your condition. Don't worry, I'll be asking simple questions. First, can you tell me what brings you to the emergency room today? I understand. Can you describe the chest pain for me? Is it sharp, dull, stabbing, or a pressure? Where exactly is the pain located? Does it radiate to any other areas? It is now asking a patient question. I see. Have you experienced this type of chest pain before? Are you currently experiencing any other symptoms like shortness of breath, nausea, or sweating? Have you taken any medication for the pain? Okay, can you tell me about your medical history? One minute. Do you have any pre-existing conditions like high blood pressure, diabetes, or heart disease? Also, are there any heart conditions in your family? Thank you for sharing that information. Mr. Tom, I'm just going to ask a couple more questions. Are you taking any medications right now? And have you recently been involved in any strenuous physical activity? Yes. Okay. Dr. Gutson, my evaluation of Mr. Tom is complete. 
based on his description of chest pain radiating to his back and the family history of heart disease. I believe this is a code epsilon situation. Mr. Tom should be seen by you immediately. Time. This was a feature of Eden. Eden asks a patient of he didn't ask a patient a variety of questions to, ev to evaluate the patient and to evaluate the, to evaluate the patient and gather the in information to determine the sever to determine the severity of the patient. In this scenario, the patient had a eps had epsilon, which is a moderate, which is mo mo moderate to See well done, Team Aiden. That was really impressive. I am very much impressed, actually. You've put a lot of thought into making this a medical chatbot. Uh, the question I'll ask you is this. So your model does a good job of asking the user questions, but I see you stopped to ask from a doc doctor's perspective. If you hadn't stopped, would it continue just asking several questions or is there a limit on how many questions it can ask uh, the user? It will continue to ask questions until it has reached a conclusion on uh, what you may be suffering from. <laughs> uh, is that to answer the question? So, thank you. education on medical information and services. Let me present our chatbot presentation. Our bot's name is Dr. Lucy. Its name originated from the French version of St. Lucia. Dr. Lucy is designed to have an outgoing and cheerful personality. It has an abundance of information in the medical sector and is educated on different emergency centers nationwide. Who is, who is Dr. Lucy? Dr. Lucy is a user-friendly medical chatbot designed to assist individuals in finding the nearest hospitals, clinics, and emergency stations. Accessing their contact information, learning about the cost of medical services, and discovering hospital opening hours. It provides quick and reliable information, making it easier for users to navigate medical services and facilities. Dr. Lucy was created to help people in solution easily find nearby medical clinics and get quick information about services. Now, um, introducing our demo. And 
my glass is broke. Can I get eye clinics in few foot? Lemis also asks, would you like your preferences? Any questions at the end? Are you satisfied? Exhibited that your chatbot had sufficient uh, localized uh, knowledge. My question would be how did the localized data into your chatbot? What was the technical approach you used? Can you repeat that question, please? So, how did you give access to local data? to your chatbot, what was the technical approach you used? Okay, so basically we call all, all the hospitals in St. Lucia and we use the St. Lucia's government sites to get all the information to put it in our code. Does that answer your question? As I was asking about the tech, so the coding side of it, how did you do that? Um, you have a picture of our code, the coding? Um, we have a picture of the code on the sites. Another picture of the code on the sides. Yes. 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 Um, We're putting back it up in one second, so please wait with us. Okay. Thank you so much. Well done. Thank you. Okay. lately work is piling up and i barely have any time to relax tell me about it between the pressure of work and everything that's going on at home i just feel totally overwhelmed and i feel like i can't talk to nobody about it i know right i wish there was something that could help you know without making me feel judged well actually there is you have medicore 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 an innovative AI-driven mental health care system designed to transform, designed to transform how you manage your mental, mental health. Picture this, a friend who never judges, always listens, and is available 24 seven. And is available 24 seven. Medicore is more than just a chatbot. It's your personalized mental health support team ready to assist you anytime, anywhere. We all know that navigating mental health can be challenging, especially in the Caribbean, but Medicore is here to change that. It's designed to provide compassionate, evidence-based support for your mental health concerns. Whether you're feeling anxious, whether you're feeling anxious, stressed, or just need someone to talk to, Medicore is like having a therapist on call, ready to guide you through tough emotions and situations. What makes Medicore stand out? Whether you are a student stressing over exam, a person managing a chronic illness, or a professional seeking balance, Medicore offers personalized recommendations based on your daily emotional state. With its user-friendly interface, Medicore Symptom Checker checks on how you are feeling that day and tailors its speech to properly provide you with the support you need. Concerned about privacy? Rest easy. Medicore takes your data seriously with all interactions securely encrypted to ensure your information remains protected and confidential. Your trust is our top priority. This is the Medicore user interface. We'll start by asking it a simple question. Can you suggest some practical ways to manage my anxiety throughout the day? Here 
is Medipolar's response. We also have a symptom checker on the side, which adjusts this, which adjusts the way the, the chat bot speaks to you. And you also have daily affirmations beneath it to keep people motivated. There you have it. Medicool, your ultimate healthcare companion. Designed to meet the needs of our users, offering support, guidance, and a peace of mind whenever you need it. Close your eyes and envision a future where everyone in our community has instant access to empathetic, personalized care. Where mental health is prioritized and stigma is a thing of the past. Open your eyes. Judges, this is your moment to bring a transformative tool to life. Let's not just talk the talk. Let's make it happen. Choose Medicore and let's build a brighter future where mental health care is accessible to all. Thank you. Mental health is a very sensitive, it's very sensitive when it comes to data. How does your, or how did your team attempt or plan to attempt to protect the user data? Or how does a chatbot, chatbot protect the user data? Or through your research, how did, through your, through your research, did you find anything in regards to data security, data privacy? Because in regards to protecting the user data. One, two. Good day. Can you hear me? Yes, I'm hearing you, sir. Yes. In regards to protecting the user data that is still being developed. So in the future, we will definitely have protocols in place to protect the user data. awareness and guidance expert, which is accurate, reliable, and accessible to all. Despite advancements in healthcare, misinformation and limited access to sexual health resources remain significant challenges. Many people struggle to find clear and trustworthy information about STDs, leading to delayed diagnosis, increased transmission, and negative health consequences. Sage is the solution. Our chatbot offers comprehensive information on various STDs, including clear explanation of each STD, the prescriptions to early detection, and in-depth analysis on procedures and medicine to return to pre-symptom levels, guidance on available treatment options and seeking professional care, comprehensive advice on safe sexual practices, and SAGE also provides locations of clinics where you can get tested for these STDs. It also provides contact info for these clinics. SAGE is available 24-7 and is always accessible to answer questions and provide support. SAGE's user-friendly design is easy to be used and approachable. And SAGE uses straightforward language and reliable information to simplify complex topics and aims to empower users with understandable and supportive guidance. SAGE is designed for individuals of all ages and backgrounds who seek accurate information about sexual health. Our primary target, our primary target audience include young adults, healthcare providers, and individuals at risk of STDs. To reach our target audience, we will leverage a multi-channel marketing approach including social media campaigns, partnerships with healthcare organizations, online advertising, and educational workshops and events. By investing in SAGE, you're investing in the health and well-being of countless individuals. Let's work together to break down barriers to sexual health information and empower people to make more informed choices. Join us in creating a healthier and more informed society. 
Thank you. And now we will now go on to the demo. Welcome to C. Truth awareness guidance and guidance expert. This intelligent chatbot and to provide empathetic, easy to understand answers about spell help based on our comprehensive data set. This is how it works. As you see, this is the user interface, which includes a sidebar that also has a disclaimer showing the the interface we have a disclaimer says that we are not professionals on usual discharge, etc. Now, let's ask another question. Time. No, Thank you, ask. students. the spread of misinformation 
and the anxiety associated with seeking medical information online. Furthermore, the teams envision CareConnect as a tool to enhance healthcare accessibility, offering support for those who may have not immediate may not have immediate access to a healthcare provider. By providing instant, accurate information, CareConnect aims to complement professional medical advice, helping users better understand their health needs and facilitating timely consultation with healthcare professionals when necessary. We are incredibly proud to announce the completion of CareConnect, our innovative medical bot. Despite having no prior coding experience and just one month of lessons under our belt, we managed to bring this project to life in just one week. This achievement is a testament to the power of teamwork, collaboration, and sheer determination. Each of us contributed our unique skills and supported one another throughout the process, demonstrating that with collective effort and passion, even the most ambitious goals can be realized. We're excited to see how CareConnect will make a difference in providing reliable medical information and graceful for the journey that brought us here. We want to extend our heartfelt thanks to the facilitators for their patience and for providing us with this incredible opportunity. A huge thank you to our teammates for their unwavering support and collaboration and to the judges and sponsors for believing in our vision. Your encouragement and guidance were crucial in making CareConnect a reality. We are deeply grateful for your contribution and for helping us achieve this mission together. Um, we've provided a video to show what CareConnect is capable of. One minute. Can you tell me how to get rid of my headache? Here, Care Connect has suggests four, five solutions that may help get rid of a headache. Let's ask Care Connect for help finding medical institutions in St. Kitts that we can visit. Time. Thank you. How is your solution different from essentially all other chatbots? Because if you ask, how, what do I do about my headache? You can ask that chat GPT cloud on literally every chatbot and they'll be able to answer it. So what makes your chatbot unique? Unlike every other chatbot, ours will activate on and off of internet. Every other chatbot, you need internet. Wi-Fi, some, kind of, some sort of connection for it to work. Ours, you may not.
When it comes to healthcare, what are our options? For prompt and efficient service, booking a private practitioner is best. However, those can be expensive. Other options would be multiple phone calls or doctor visits, but those can be timely and lead to deterioration of a patient's condition. Now, at the end of the day, given all this, people still do not get the healthcare that they deserve and need. Due to lack of information, or bad and poor information. Fortunately, we have a solution. Meet Medibot, your AI personal health companion. Medibot is an advanced medical chatbot designed to streamline access to health information and their services. Medibot, why Medibot, you may ask? Well, Medibot offers 24 hour availability. So at any point of the day, no matter when you need it, or want it, you can get the information that you need. And its efficiency boasts maximum potential. With Medibot, all frequently asked questions and general queries can be answered and is also readily available for people such as medical practitioners to focus on more serious cases that would require their attention. Medibot Health bridges the gap in healthcare access, providing valuable resources to those who might otherwise struggle to find the care that they need. Medibot is also a good source of health information, offering guidance and maintaining a healthy lifestyle and answering frequently asked health questions. Our platform is designed to help users find medical institutions that offer specific services they need, like ultrasounds of blood tests right in their areas. Whether you're looking for a specialized clinic 
or just Benyasa, our service has recovered. Not only do we help find these facilities, but we also provide essential details like contact information, operating hours, and even facility regions. This ensures that you make informed decisions about your medical needs. Here we have some coding highlights. This coding highlight is showing how we gathered our information and placed them together to show what we gained and how we will be addressed to you in format. Now this would show this coding highlight here shows how when you type in your info what you want, it displays all the information, whether it be the address, the center, the phone hours, the ratings, and the fees. And now we'll go to the live demonstration of our chatbot. Right here, we are currently searching a response for what you would get for a proper diet that you would you know. Everyone wants to be healthy, you want to look good, so you want a proper diet. So right there, asking Medibot. And here he give he gives you a breakfast, lunch, and dinner menu that will be efficient at keeping your weight low with lean protein. <laughs> One minute. And here we are looking for medical services. Now, Maribot lists all the services, all the places where you can get the service within your area even the fees, the price, and the hours they open. Also ratings, because you want the best options. <laughs> Please note that all our prices we have there are not real. They are just a demonstration of what we, we'll of what we we'll assume it would be in real life. Yeah. <laughs> That is it for our showcase. Thank you very much for listening. Okay. So the question is that for Medipot, right, what makes it unique compared to other available chatbots? Because the question you asked about diet, uh, most chatbots can do that. So what is unique about Medipot? From my personal experience, when using Google Maps, they normally, when I have to look for all the information I want, I normally have to look for it like very in depth, like scroll a lot. But with Medibot, when you when you type what you're looking for, it gives you everything you need one time. Contact information, where it's located, facility ratings, operating hours, everything comes at one time. <laughs> Something. And with Medibot. Instead of you having to search for multiple things, because with information such as a uh, medical center, such as, you know, to get MRIs, one search and you will get free in the area immediately with ratings. And also the price range, it, while not exact, it is a great estimate. So that would be good for people on either a low budget and for people that generally don't have much information on such things. So educate those unfamiliar with radiology, helping them understand its purpose and function. Benefits of radiology benefits radiologists by reducing their workload of having to answer every call as radiologists are assistant that saves time and effort. 
you a small definition of x-ray it gives you a small definition of x-ray um, how it is is done. Um, Mandy, uh, so for forgive us if it's a looks a little bare bones or um, if it isn't uh, completely, you know. Hey, this is my team behind me, my lovely team, uh, programmer. We had three. We had three programmers, and no, just two of us. And it was our research team and our. Uh, oh, our research team, and I will give it over to my my partner. Here. Enhancing healthcare and disaster response: the role of Mandy. Introduction to Mandy. Sorry, Mandy, a medical chatbot powered by the state-of-the-art large language modules, is designed to provide users with accurate and well-informed medical information for a wide range of concerns. MANDI stands for Medical and Natural Disaster Informant, reflecting its dual focus on offering reliable healthcare guidance and supporting natural disaster efforts. Benefits of MANDI. MANDI is an AI-powered chatbot available 24-7 to anyone with an internet connection. It provides accurate medical information based on the latest research, addressing a wide range of health concerns. MANDI also includes data on medical facilities in St. Lucia, such as hospitals and pharmacies, helping users easily find access to local medical resources. Additionally, Manti offers essential information on natural disaster preparedness and response, including emergency services and key contacts, making it a valuable resource in times of crisis. Enhancing patient engagement. Often, patients are discharged from hospitals prematurely due to the lack of beds available. Patients who are already discharged can utilize money to quickly answer any concerns they may have while at home. With Manti, patients can set their mind at ease knowing that they have an instant access to a medical informant. Improving disaster response. After natural disasters, 
Individuals often need quick access to critical information. Mandi provides immediate guidance on emergency services, shelter locations, and safety protocols, helping users navigate uncertain situations and make informed decisions. Challenges and limitations. Mm -hmm. Mandi is a near-perfect system, but unfortunately, in order to access the artificial intelligence system that provides its well-informed results, Mandi must be given a reliable internet connection. This limits the access to Mandi from lower-income individuals. Future of Mandi. Team Mandi is committed to enhancing our chatbot with new features to better support users. We plan to introduce capabilities such as speech-to-text or easier communication and direct calling functionalities to connect users with emergency services or medical professionals. In conclusion, in conclusion, Mandy can enhance patient. In conclusion, Mandy can enhance patient care and disaster response with real-time updates and support its integration can be crucial for building resilient healthcare systems and effective disaster responses. Continued investment can ensure preparedness for future challenges. Thank you for listening. Ow. Thank you, Team Mandy. Now we will have the demo. Here is what Mandy looks like right now. One minute. And uh, we will start. We'll start by showing you one of its questions. What is your purpose? As you can see, Mandy is explaining what its purpose is. It's supposed to give you all the information you need of natural disasters and medical information from a solution. There's another question for Mandy. What are the emergency shelters in Castries? Here you go, another response explaining everything you need to know about emergency shelters in Castries. And let us do one more question. Time. Oh, that's it for Mandy. Sorry, if it looks like a skeleton and everything else looks, you know, at least we tried. Thank you. Good morning, everyone. Team Mandy, um, the acronym, just remind us of the acronym for Team Mandy, what it means. And it's a very applicable chatbot. Uh, you mentioned you must need internet connection. Any, any future advancement in having this chatbot available offline, especially for persons who may not have uh, internet connectivity during the, the disaster or so? Well, for your first question, MANDI stands for Medical and Natural Disaster Informant. And to answer your second question about the internet connectivity, MANDI is still in its development phase, so that feature of offline relativity will be in the future. So it's still in its programming phase. Thank you. Friendly healthcare assistant chatbot generated with Gemini and Python code. With questions related to your healthcare needs, we chose the name because of one syllable word and memorable. Some features of STAR include its ability to give information about healthcare services in Sanusha. Our chatbot has contact information for all health centers and hospitals, including the different divisions and rooms. In addition to contacts for health centers, STAR also have information about emergency numbers and help hotlines, as well as the cost of health procedures that can be carried out at health centers. Help diagnose patients. STARS knowledge of common diseases and sicknesses in St. Lucia and the Caribbean and can suggest treatments or ways they can be prevented. Advice about healthy lifestyle choices like diet and exercise, depending on a person's age, can also be accessed. <laughs> Star can also give information specific to people with lifestyle diseases like diabetes or hypertension. 
provide incident information to users. Star is friendly and can give information to users within a matter of seconds. Though it is trained to answer health-related questions, it always answers with a disclaimer that it is not a medical professional and will advise the user to seek proper medical attention or direct, to, or direct the user to contact a health center or hospital of their choice. Next, we'd like to talk about, talk about our development process. In the public account, we were placed into our respective groups where we started brainstorming ideas to our names and functions of our chatbot. We would like our assistant and met bottles potential meetings for star. But we decided that they sounded too gloomy and serious for the personality that we wanted the assistant to have. After determining a name, we quickly got to researching which was one of the most difficult and tasking part of building star. Find accurate information about each health center with limited availability of it online was no easy task. When we were done with research and data collecting, it was placed into tables with appropriate headings, then converted into JSON files. We decided to store different categories in different files, as it would be easier to edit or correct data if there were any mistakes or information that needed to be added. We then loaded each file into, into the code and sent it individually to the transport initial prompt. Next, we will have the live demonstration of our chatbot. Our first question will be asking Star what are its capabilities. One minute. As with any project, we encountered some difficulties during our process. For example, incorrect or outdated information and issues with our send message button where it would generate double responses. Some things that we would like to improve or add to start in the future are it being able to give prescription and information about over-the-counter and prescription drugs, giving directions and pictures to health facilities so that users can find it easier and being able to diagnose patients from pictures as well as text. Thank you. Is this um, checkbox added to the, to, the, to the world of this, this technology? How does this, how do cancer motions benefit from it that is so different from what we have existing um in, in the mainstream well in my experience a lot of time in saint Lucia, when you well we experienced this while searching for information at hospitals all to the time when you call and ask for information you often get left on hold for like 20 minutes i've been been on hold on a call for actually 30 minutes just trying to get information for the chat box and because we actually got from information from a parent of one of our team members, and because of that, we were able to further its knowledge. So instead of with the knowledge that our chatbot now has, people can be able to use it instead of having to be on a call and for a long time and wasting credit and money and time. Okay. Thank you. It's a good effort, um, and like it, it's um, useful. I get, I get. We all know how challenging it can be to access reliable pediatric information, especially in moments of stress. Whether it's late at night with a sick child or your brother wakes up with a high fever, accurate and timely information is critical. Now picture having a pediatric assistant right in your home offering guidance in your language anytime. This is the reality for Kids Care Hub. We've identified three key challenges families face in pediatric care. One, limited access to reliable information. Two, language barriers in understanding medical advice. And three, 
difficult determining when to seek professional help. Well, Kids Care Hub and our AI assistant Raya solves these problems hands on. Raya is more than just a chat box, guys. She's a trusted companion in pediatric care. Imagine the relief of having instant and her responses in your native language, whether it's English, Spanish, French, even Dutch. With so much cultural diversity in the Caribbean, do you know how hard it is for some people to get advice from doctors when not even the doctors can understand what they're saying? Boom! Dr. Rhea drops in, speaking every island lingo. Dutch? Check! No sweat! Your symptoms? Your language? Letting in fast responses. She provides tailored, child-friendly advice based on your child's age and symptoms, ensuring personalized care at your fingertips. We have created a comprehensive directory of Sankey's pediatric facilities with easy-to-use contact information. Our innovative text-to-speech feature allows doctorate to read advice aloud, perfect for multitasking parents or children who prefer to listen. While well, doctorate is incredibly capable, we understand the importance of human connection. That's why we've integrated a direct link to SKN Health operators available at the touch of a button. Introduced in our demo. What should I do? Oh, I know. Let's ask Kids Care Hub. Oh, wow. This layout is so pretty. And it's so easy to understand. What does this button do? That mode? That's so cool. Now let's type in all the necessary requirements. so that we can go to the doctor. This bot is so cool. It has eight different languages and provides information about local health clinics and also show the exact location on Google Maps. Now for the game changer. I can't wait. Now for the game changer. Dr. Ray has significantly reduced its health care causes, costs by providing accurate, timely advice she helps parents make informed decisions about doctor visits, saving time, and cutting unnecessary expenses. Let's be real, who doesn't want to save money? Kids Care Hub's mission is simple. One, we aim to reduce unnecessary emergency room visits. Two, save parents the time and worry when dealing with common childhood illnesses. And three, bridge the language gap in healthcare, ensuring each family One minute. is clear and understandable medical advice. In a world where timely, accurate information makes all the difference, Doctoria stands as a beacon of trust in pediatric care. We're not just building an app. We're building healthcare communities where every child has access to quality information and every parent has a peace of mind. Thank you for your time. We're excited to answer any questions and discuss how Kids Care Hub can become a valuable resource in our community. A voice, a female voice. It's common to feel tired and dizzy at your age due to hormonal changes and increased physical activity. Make sure to get enough rest, stay hydrated, and eat a healthy diet to improve your energy levels. If your symptoms persist, Consult with your pediatrician for further evaluation. Remember, it's time. important to take care of your body and focus on your health at this age. Thank you. Wondering, um, I wanted to see how you interact with the, the other languages. Um, is it able to, to decipher between the languages? Um, so can I have an automatic Spanish translation? Yes, it actually does have, um, you could select which language you want the response to be in. Sadly, because of streamlit limitations, we could not provide, like, make the whole text change into Spanish, but we have a drop down box on this side. So you could select whichever language you want, and based on the language you select, the response would be in 
that language. And we shall, we're going to show it on the computer. <laughs> Si tienes un fuerte dolor de cabeza, debes avisar a tus padres o tutores inmediatamente. Ellos te ayudarán a tomar algún medicamento o descansar hasta que te sientas mejor. Si lo deseas, puedes probar a ponerte una compresa fría en la frente o beber un poco de agua para ver si eso ayuda. Recuerda. Es importante pedir siempre ayuda cuando no te sientes bien. Would you agree that Gen Z's are the future? I am sure you will say yes. Well, meet Shamar, a Caribbean businessman, a Gen Z in person, who is hoping to start his own business. But one of the major issues is that he is living in the Caribbean business could be washed away by the next natural disaster. So, Crisis Navigator is here to save the day. For starters, Crisis Navigator provides information for Gen Z's interested in starting businesses. These countries include Antigua and Barbuda, Bahamas, Barbados, Belize, Dominica, Grenada, Haiti, Jamaica, St. Kitts and Nevis, St. Lucia, St. Vincent and the Grenadines, Trinidad and Tobago. In each country, Gen Z has the access to two insurance firms which they can contact to get information. Insurance coverage. Crisis navigator also is a type of coverage. There is also a list of construction firms through our external API. There is also opportunity for Gen Z's to research how they can ensure that they are building strong, building strong reference documents such as OECS building code. It is the hope of the team that we can incorporate building regulations so that we can not only ensure we build strong, but ensure we do it. Do this within the legal framework, which is designed to protect lives and property. Don't wait for a disaster to catch you off guard. I encourage small business association, the business work on the whole to support venture. Just to wrap up, even though it is not finished, it was supposed to be able to tell other Gen Zs who are trying to create a business to a chatbot but i think you have a very good idea um so would i be able to 
view, would I, would the chatbot be able to calculate what my insurance would be like for my particular business? No, oh, miss. It it's will, it will give you the insurance, like business info for the insurance company. And uh, it will give you like, like websites you can check, check it's on and the number for the business, well, the insurance company. Okay, thank you. Long wait, feeling like you, you are losing brain cells when dealing with the outdated medical system, and more so, being anxious uh, when you have a pending medical procedure. I am hyped to introduce medicines, our new chatbot that's about to make your medical journey a whole lot less of a hot mess. Medicis is designed to prepare you for scheduled medical procedures such as surgeries. Medical procedures which are frequently done at the Sir Lester Bird Medical Center. It will assist you in finding out key details like the prices for the surgery, getting over fears of the procedure, and how to adequately prepare. Medicis will also elaborate on each surgery type. Okay, still don't get it. Medicis is here to sort out everything you need for the surgery, from the price tag to, to easing those pre-op nerves. It'll even make sure you're in the right age bracket, so no oops, not yet moments. And it's got the 411 on all the surgeries done in Antigua. As you know, healthcare is super important, and the healthcare sector can be a bit stretched. So we call on our healthcare leaders to come and have a look at Medicis giving instant access to all the details at your patient's fingertips about pending medical procedures. Eliminate the snail pace drama of waiting around and hello to a slick modern way of provi providing that layer of assurance. Choose medicines. <laughs> Medicis is the most effective way of getting information from Sir Lester Bird Medical Center, and I'm here to prove it. First, we used Streamlit, OpenAI, LLM Chain, and Pandas to create our chatbot. Now for the demonstration. So first, here, I will introduce you to Metasys. Met here, logo. Now, in the sidebar, we have some additional information for those who are seeking to know what Metasys is all about. I will now ask it a question. What are it or I'm asking what orthopedic surgery is as it is one of the most common surgeries done here in Antigua. It will it will give you a response of what uh, orthopedic surgery is. Uh, where it is usually worked on, and how to prepare for it. Now I can ask for what the price is. One minute. And it will give you an exact uh, price on how much orthopedic inpatient surgery is. I asked what orthopedic inpatient surgery is as 
it is usually recommended for the patient to stay in the hospital after an orthopedic surgery. And all the prices are specifically for Sir Lester Bird's Medical Center. So thank you very much. Good afternoon, team. <laughs> a very, a very niche chatbot. Um, it will be very helpful as well to the patients at that clinic. Tell me something about the, the information it provides um, on surgeries. Would it provide pre-surgery preparation, recovery tips, follow-up care, and so on, with regards to surgeries itself? Our chatbot provide information on how to prepare for the surgeries, uh, for the surgery, obviously, and it will also give you information on how you should recover from the surgery. Repeat the last one, sorry. How to recover how to from recover. the surgery. How you will recover from the surgery. Okay, okay. Great job. Thank you. A Christmas Eve trial passed and it caused damages which cost $99.8 million. In 2010, Hurricane Thomas was a bit major which caused $336 million US dollars in damages. Then, Hurricane Dean, which was in 2004, wasn't really major, but cost, caused around $18.18 million USD in damages. Year after year, system after system, we lose people, we lose infrastructure, and we have to start all over again. This is only in St. Lucia. There are many more of these examples throughout the country. Too often in our disaster prone region, the public lacks the crucial information and resources necessary to ensure the safety and effectively rebuild after hazard events. What if I told you there was a solution to this information crisis? Introducing the Weather Wizard, an innovative AI powered chatbot that will assist in rebuilding homes, livelihoods, and communities. Weather Wizard provides real time updates on weather, floods, and landslides. It guides users to the nearest shelters, medical facilities, open roads, and relief centers. It also offers vital information on how and where to access necessary resources for disaster preparations and relief. What does Weather Wizard do? Weather Wizard answers questions and holds a conversation for a long period of time. Given current weather conditions, we suggested actions that can be taken based on this. Weather Wizard provides information about medical centers, emergency shelters, and essential sites during hurricanes or other disasters. It also provides information on what to do prior, mid, and post disasters. Here, we have some coding highlights. This particular one shows the code that suggests an activity based on the current weather. For example, if there's a drizzle, the suggestion is to grab your favorite umbrella and take extra care on the road. Now, we are going to show you the live demo. Weather Wizard is able to give the current weather condition and temperature as well as a suggestion based on this. It is able to answer general questions and is customized to give information about hospitals, health centers, and emergency shelters in St. Lucia. It also gives the links for essential sites such as NEMO, National Hurricane Center, construction companies, and local news sites. Thank you. Yeah. Is your chatbot child friendly? And the second question, is it only localized or you can check the weather in other Caribbean countries? Oh my God, what a step. Good afternoon. I believe what a wizard is very child friendly. It's simple, easy, and anybody can really use it. Um, as for general weather, you can check for anywhere. All you need to know is generally the capital. So, like if you ask for London, it would give you the weather in London. You can ask for basically anywhere. Um, but for health center, it can give health centers, hospitals, and hurricane shelters for only in St. Lucia.
right now, although I wish to be able to further that. Good job, team. Thank you. Some of the earliest I put my skip get improved Brand new fight and clean fam ID Me and me call it hobby and wife Never know to me so show me off a function Never read them and run cause Sink it, sink it, sink it Tell it run up brand new code as they hold Ten times and be ready to record Cross in the logic to make it flow Welcome to our world, come join the free. 